One year ago, we stood in front of our house telling you how excited we are to start Mike's Car Store. Now, one year in, Mike's Car Store is doing great. We're standing in front of the car store to tell you we're starting a new business. We're really excited to tell you what this business is and you're gonna love it. My love and passion for cars is through the roof. You guys know that, obviously I'm a huge Chevy guy. But uh, having Rich here and having the Ferraris and Lamborghinis and stuff show up uh, allows me to talk to these people as well that I've never really talked to in the past. And with Rich here, I can use him to uh, maybe transform this business idea that we're going to start. I'm telling them about the new business. They don't know what it is yet. But Rich has got a lot of customers that I think this new business can use, right? Yeah. I, I think it's going to be a really good partnership that we already have with Mike's Car Store, but now with the new business, it's gonna be stronger partnership. And I might even hire your wife. I'm gonna make her a manager, which would be your boss at home and at work. I don't like you already. <laughs> but in order to get this business going, we need another building. So we're gonna have to run down and I can't drive my truck. So I don't know when we're gonna launch this video to you guys, but uh, I sold my truck by accident and we've bought another one. And if, if, if I put this video up afterwards, go right here somewhere. and. You can see the truck we bought. A few moments later. All right, and here we are to the building that we are looking at. So a couple of things you're gonna recognize, the train tracks, right? And uh, that red door, that was our old red door. And uh, so the train tracks butts up next to our building and we are at the home of Citadel Constructors, which is right down the street from our current building. We're not looking to kick them out, but I am looking at this building right here for this business everything happens for a reason in life and the more things you do the luckier you get and um this billboard comes up for uh available to use starting january 1 so when i saw that come up i'm like yes i want this billboard it cost me 200 bucks a month right it's chump change it's nothing i don't want to do billboard advertising but i'm sitting here thinking that hey, I can put, buying a car doesn't have to suck, get Mike's car store, half mile down the road, whatever it is, distance down there. But then I talked about this building and he told me that this is for lease as well, which brings us to us starting our very own detail shop. So we're starting our own detail center and uh, I've got a package coming from an amazing company that's gonna show you how much into this that we are. All right, so here is the inside of the building and this, I think this works absolutely perfect. So uh, certainly we've got room for a car here, we got room for a car here, and we got really room for one or two cars here when you look at it. So it's heated up here, not AC, so not, we'll have to worry about that down the road, but pretty much everything you see in here is going away. So the, the benches are going away, all that's going away. There's air already in here, there's water in here, and uh, we're gonna put water over here so we can put the um, uh, pressure washer right here so that way you can wash cars. There's no drains inside the building, um, so we'll have to wash cars outdoors uh, for right now, but there's plenty of room here so this will always stay here this big semi trailer uh, but we have plenty of room to uh, put a car here or a car here and wash cars out here even in the winter time uh, to do stuff or worst case scenario we uh, put uh, a car right here and we wash it in this area right here and we just squeegee you know squeegee the water out this place looks pretty awesome what do you what do you think you tell me if you think this is going to be a good place to start a detail shop and then in here we've got like a little area that they're going to put up this uh, granite countertop in here there's a bathroom right there so it'll be a nice place to have uh, an area for customers to come into as well and another idea i have is uh, since i'm buying that new truck uh, I needed to buy a uh, tonneau cover and I've always been loyal to Chevy about buying tonneau covers because that's where I worked. Well, now I work for myself and I can actually buy uh, these tonneau covers for a whole lot cheaper than what you see for retail. So that I've already got that set up and I've already bought that tonneau cover for my new truck. So that's something that we can do too is uh, truck car accessories like the floor mats and all that stuff. But uh, this building is, is I think pretty awesome and uh, we'll be able to do some really awesome things here but i want to surprise you guys with one more thing and uh ups is getting ready to drop off what i think is a pretty amazing package that's what he said so as i head back to the store 
and uh, wait for UPS. I want to tell you this quick story of where this all stems from of looking at this building. And uh, I had a great detailer. I was in absolute just, just, just coasting, cruise control on, no issues. And uh, the average detail price of a car lot that does, you know, a lot of details every single month generally ranges from 120 maybe max 200 max like like they're doing a lot of work for 200 bucks so um i dealt with a brand new detailer brand new in the business he kind of opened his business right when i opened my business and for like a year prior he was kind of you know doing it as a side hustle that turned into a uh, full-time position i really like this guy and uh, even after this story nothing but respect and, and want to see well wishes for his business so when i started the car lot i came to him and said hey listen um i need my car detailed and um i'll i'll do 225 dollars per car knowing that i'm overpaying by almost a hundred dollars so so we um you might want to be wearing that seat belt by the way have everything going good some of the cars most of the cars are really really simple a couple of them here and there were really dirty and a lot of paint work so now he's came to me because his employees cannot get a car done within eight hours and uh that's not my problem that's his problem and he wants to charge me more money he wants to charge me 450 dollars per car and i'm like dude that can't happen right tells me that his employee wants to quit because he pays them on commission and all that stuff and i'm like that's not a me problem that's a you problem and we unfortunately we didn't have the discussion so we just ended that business relationship and uh, I was stuck finding someone else. So I found a couple of their detailers at $120 a piece and they do the exact same job as what he does. And to go a little bit further into that, they actually get cars done in four hours. So if I got two cars here, they're getting two cars done in one day uh, with one person doing the job. So um, with that being said, we are gonna start our own detail shop so that we, we can be in control of getting our stuff cleaned in a timely manner at our price. And then uh, we can help you guys out too, uh, because as soon as this UPS package gets here, I'm really, really excited to show you what it is because this is gonna take our detail shop over the top. Hello buddy, how are you? I'm doing all right, how are awesome. you Thank you. Yep. It says it's fragile. There's liquid in here. Does this give it away? I don't know if this gives it away. But uh, we can now say that we are an official ceramic pro dealer. Yes, so uh, we're gonna be doing PPF. We're gonna be doing uh, the, the ceramic coating. We're gonna be doing window tinting. We're gonna do everything with the new detail shop. So really, really excited to be a ceramic pro dealer. This was tough to get a hold of and to be able to do, but they worked it out for me. And I was super excited to start out with an amazing company that I love. So the next thing we've got to do is let you guys know the name of our detail company. This has been something very thought out of. And of course, when we are looking at names, we have to make sure URLs are available. We have to make sure Instagram names are available, Facebook names are available, all that stuff. So the official name of our detail shop is called Five Diamond Detailing. So this is the logo right here. Check the logo out. That's the front of a C8 up there, which I think is really, really cool. And then most importantly, when will we be open for business? We're projecting that our first day of operation is going to be January 2nd, 2023. Everything's all secured. The building's secure. Our website is in development right now, which is going to be 5diamonddetailing.com. The number five and the word five spelled out. See how important it is to make sure we're naming our companies correctly because if somebody types out F-I-V-E, or puts the number five in, it's gonna be redirected to the right site where we're gonna be starting out in January. We're gonna work on detailing, we're gonna work on ceramic coating, and we're also going to be working on paint correction. And then down the road, very, very quickly, we wanna ramp this company up very quick. We're gonna start working on PPF, and we're also gonna start working on window tinting. But most importantly, the one thing that we do need is some employees. So if you wanna work with us and you've got some experience in any of those categories that I just mentioned, I'm gonna throw an email address down in the description below, as well as all of our Instagram handles, Facebook, all that stuff. Go down there, give it a follow, and you'll be able to watch this company progress just like you've watched Mike's Car Store.